Hey, what's going on guys? Sam Winian here, and today I'm going to be showing you the 12 anvils in the HBM Nuclear Tech Mod. Okay, let's get into it, shall we? So, there is, um, actually, there's only 10. There's 10 anvils in the HBM Nuclear Tech Mod, and I'm going to show you what they all do. Basically, they all are used to create machines and uh, machine parts and stuff. Let's say you got copper plates. Got four of those. You can make one copper panel. Say if you have four stone bricks, two iron ingots, four um, tungsten ing ingots, and two copper panels, you can get one blast furnace. Now these have different levels. This is tier one, actually. It's not levels; they're tiers. You can get a basic circuit assembly. It looks like you have a chance to get like some of the stuff back. But you can make like some ammo and stuff, ammo casings and stuff. Here's this one, that's the regular one. This one goes up, um, actually no, this is still tier one. You can have an iron one, a lead one, steel. This is tier two, this will give you a, like an assembly machine. Yeah, I think that's new. It gives you new ammo types, look at that. You have like a lot more ammo types, just like with tier two. You can make these little circuit boards. You can make a Chicago pile uranium rod using three uranium billets and two iron plates. There's a reference here I don't get guaranteed. Is there like a reactor for this or something? So why is this my first time hearing about this? Huh. Oh. There is some sort of reference here. I just do not know what it is. It seems like whatever it's referencing, it's uh, referencing a bunch of bad practices. I'm going to have to do some research when I'm done with this. Tier 3 has more motors and stuff. This is a dash motor. This is my favorite, the auxiliary cooling tower. You can make radioactive barrels, vitrified. Radioactive barrels, nuclear waste barrel. This is where you get all your plates, I guess. Interesting. Oh, you can uh, take, like, powder coal and whatever and put it back into, like, right... Oh, you know, that'd be great, like, in conjunction with, like, any sort of, like, uh, mod that, like... That would be great in, like, Sky Factory or something. Maybe, like, Diamond Dust or something. We got... We, he can get a, um... If he put input 10, um... 50 BMC, uh... Um, rounds, flechette rounds. You get one, and and if you put one one reactor grate, a americium rod, you can get ten fifty bmg uh, americium pipe. Hey, <laughs> he's got an American flag. That's that's funny. I made that joke too <laughs> a long time ago. If you put some polonium in there, you can. That's cool too. It's got a Poland flag. That's that's so funny. You get more. Oh, look at that. You can actually make barrels with this. It's the same kind of fuel. I actually in there twice, isn't it? Okay, here's the uh, star metal one. I think these are both tier three. Yeah, I'm not gonna search through those. These is this is tier four. I I think we can make that in the other one. You can't make this in the other one. I know that. Or the cooling tower. You might be able to. I I might I might have forgotten. More plates and stuff. It's the same thing really. A lot of ammo. There's actually a search bar here. Which is great. So if you want to look up like, uh, say you were looking up uh, cooling tower, 
but it's cool. <laughs> you can abbreviate it. That's great. There you go. There's that. Where is the end of this? I do want to see the end of this. You get wires out of this. This is cool. So, like, as you gradually play the game, you can actually, like, upgrade your anvil then. I have something else. Versatile chipset. So, you got chipsets now. Oh, we can make freaking RBMK parts now. Isn't that great? <laughs> Let me turn this off for a second. So, uh, actually, you know what? That would probably have been a good idea. So, let's say here, um... Oh, you can you can recycle them. Oh, that's what that means. It's recycling crafting recipes. Look how much stuff you can get from a uh, like a nuclear reactor, like a regular one, not an RBMK one. I was confused about what that was. That's cool. So you can actually recycle stuff. This is level five. Let's see what this one gives us. See if it gives us any like upgrades to the RBMK line up here. We can still uh like uh, recycle stuff like that. I'm just constantly clicking. I wish there was like a scroll, like an easier way of scrolling through all of this. Of course, not everybody's trying to see the end of this. They usually just search it up and call it a day. <laughs> Uh, this man, uh, pretty much the same things. But, uh, interesting. Is this tier? F oh, that's tier four. This is tier six. Oh, you can make one of those little. Oops. You can make one of those um. Little compound plates that kind of look like those little uh, strawberry wafers, and you can make one of these uh, armor plating things. That's cool. They look like them strawberry wafers. I that like that freaking uh, that plate looks like a strawberry wafer, and it makes me hungry. This is more of a, this is a recycling section again. Look at that! You can actually recycle stuff now. Isn't that cool? Okay, so um, look at that. That's the one looks tasty too. I bet this one be like blueberry, or maybe like elderberry or something. This one looks like it'd probably be uh, probably cherry and maybe like licorice. <laughs> I'm hungry. Gosh, look at all these ammo types though. Five six. I honestly, that's. I don't know if that's cheap or not. You still have to craft it manually. Just more recycling. Dang it. This is, this is the uh, highest tier imaginable, tier nineteen sixteen sixteen nine. That's a lot of numbers. You make these blast resistant bricks, which is great. More primer types and stuff like that. More, uh, more of these, I think. And the typical recyclable stuff. Interesting. If you're wondering if these actually fall, they turn into a brick and then they hit the ground. Now the brick will be colored. The brick will be colored in the like what kind of anvil it is. My personal favorite, ah, uh, I don't know. Hmm. My personal favorite is this one because it I like blue and this is a nice blue color. My second favorite would probably be this one. It's got like that little rainbow shine to it. And then my third favorite would probably be this little Twilight Sparkle looking thing. <laughs> I 
neutro um, neutronium or whatever. We're just gonna call it this Twilight Sparkle looking thing. Anyway, that's it for all uh, 10 anvils in the HBM Nuclear Tech Mind. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.